uplifting Arizona, combating loneliness and isolation with love. Folks at a Sun City Senior Center getting a crash course on dating in the 21st century. When people ask whether seniors still need an active love life, Sandy Johnson delivers an epic response. I'd say for sure, man. <laughs> for sure. You feel the same inside and you don't feel any difference, you know? The 79-year-old lost her husband of 50 years nearly a decade ago. While she's filled her life with family, friends, and hobbies, it's been hard not to be intrigued by online dating. Because it keeps coming out everywhere, that's how I got kind of excited when we were going to learn how to do it. <laughs> In April, the Banner Olive Senior Center hosted its first dating class. People that are lonely, people that maybe are widows or widowers, people that are just looking for someone to go to the movies with, we thought, why don't we give people the tools so that they can find someone? She says it's not only about finding love safely, but combating the health effects that come along with social isolation. Loneliness is such a big factor for poor health. It can affect your heart. It can affect your uh, length of life. In fact, studies show it can also increase the risk of dementia. In class, seniors like Sandy got a crash course in online dating, learning what sites are reputable and how to build a profile. My taste in music is old time rock and roll and country western. But most importantly, how to meet someone safely in the real world and not be taken advantage of. I'm happy with what I'm doing right now and I'm going very slow just like in our lessons. Lessons that warn of scams and giving out too much personal information. So far the class has been a hit. There's a couple people that have gotten into some serious relationships. For Sandy, she's keeping her options open, hoping the one is right around the corner. But I hope I find somebody that's active like me and doesn't just want to um, watch John Wayne on TV. I'm ABC 15's Cameron Polum, and that's Uplifting Arizona.